Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with Timberborn. Last episode I made a new district and I just recently broke it. <laughs> I moved the district center from here to here and it caused some issues. I think we have to re-send them back over. So we're going to migrate population, send eight, hmm, eight beavers over maybe? And see if they actually move. The reason I moved this over is I kind of wanted to move the district boundaries over this way and over this way because I want to start moving this way. Let's put some... Uh, I missed a road here. Put a path here. Check our limits, see how far we can get here. Okay. Put things on fast speed. Okay, we got our workers back at least. I think I only have shelter for... How many are in here? We have homeless. <laughs> homeless zero. Oh yeah, we can hold nine. I migrated eight, so we're good. This episode, I got a recommendation. I think it was to increase the height of this here, uh, which would cause all this to flood unless we put a wall here. In which case it would flood all of this around here. I don't really want to do that. I'm not sure if that's what they meant or not, but... Uh, basically to raise the water level. Right now I think it's a good amount. Um, we could shave this down a bit with explosives. But I think I'm just going to use this as a big growing area. And try to have this second colony... As a self-sustained self colony with food and stuff. I have, the, I have this turned off. I should probably turn it back on. Uh, we also need to start making paper. And my storage is getting full, I just noticed. So we're making explosives. Uh, not paper, but books. Let's see here. We've got... I think that's under wood, maybe? The printing press. This is what we want. Because with books, we get... Uh, get some more buffs. But we're... Well, we put this thing. I think I started making a place for it right here. Uh, I just need to move some stuff over. Might have to move my road over a little bit here, and then... I don't think I'll... I might have room right here if we remove some of these roads here. Let's see. Delete these. And then maybe place it in here somewhere. Printing press. Yeah, we could jam it right in here, maybe. I think that would work. It's going to be connected to all my other power buildings. I think I want some more platforms here so we can get around the back. And maybe build a road along here so they can get there. We still want to grow the population as well. Uh, we got a lot of research points queued up. Maybe we can uh, unlock this last monument here, maybe? 12,000. Okay, we're not ready for that yet. We can unlock some of those other stuff. Scarecrow, log fence. These are cheap. We'll just bang them off here. Sure, why not? Uh, they're pretty cheap. Metal fence. I don't think I'll use these anytime soon, but you never know. Bench, sure. Don't actually want to build it though. I've been thinking of trying to get over here and cutting a path in between here and here to fill this with water and then fill this with water ultimately. And then have growable areas around it. This is kind of wasted space back here. Um, I've got a drought coming. I mean, ultimately, this is all wasted space because there's no water in here. But if we built a water channel through here... Uh, and then over here, we could build like a pond that would greenify all of this. So that's one option. Uh, yeah, maybe I'll consider doing that. I think I need to build the channel first though on this end. 
Let's see what that would look like. I think I need more path though. Right to here maybe. Have to turn things around here so we can see what we're doing. Okay, explosives. Yeah, so something like if we went from here over I can't tell what I'm doing here. We gotta turn around to this angle to see. So right through here, if we blew this up. And made um how many explosives do I have? 119. I think a channel like this maybe? It doesn't need to be too wide, I don't think, but we'll make it too wide. Kind of like that. And then put a pool in here somewhere. We might not be able to reach this. I'm not sure if they need a path. Let's see where this district ends. Oh no, it's in there. I think they'll be able to build all that. And then we can start getting ready for on the other side as well. Like here. Shave this down. Is that reachable? I think it should be. Got to take this tree out. That's the idea at least. And then we can get uh, water flowing here. We're going to have to uh, make a pit in here though, somewhere. Let's, uh... Construction site is too far away. Okay, yeah, we'll build past there eventually. I don't know how big we need this to be. But well, we could start with that and make it bigger later if we need to. It's going to use up a lot of explosives, but uh, that's okay. Let's see if a path here will help. Probably not, but we'll do it. Okay, that's that plan in action. Uh, let's see if we got any... Uh, Stuff going on here. No employed, unemployed beavers. Okay, we gotta free up some beavers here. We got eight children, that's probably the issue. Okay, we got two unemployed now. We gotta let some kids grow up. Now, I don't know what the end game really is, except filling up the whole map. We've unlocked a good chunk of stuff. Uh, not everything yet, but getting there. In terms of research. Ultimately, we could build a giant dam up here. I don't really know what my grand plan is yet. Uh, I was thinking about doing like half or a third of the map. The map's pretty damn big here. Okay, our drought started. I was curious about what would happen during the drought here with this area right here. Whether we could, like, these are floodgates, whether I could drain these. I think I have them turned off right now. So if we set them to height high, this should stay relatively full. And I gotta set some tree cutting area here because there's no trees being cut in this area here. That should get that beaver going and some over here. Okay, uh, can we set some explosives off here? Are these all built? I can't really tell what's going on here. No, they're not built yet. Can they reach these, though? Can't really tell. Maybe they can. It looked like we had some books made there. I also put in some beehives. Ooh, there's a lot. I'm gonna put in another beehive, maybe... I don't know what the bonus for these are. It says it boosts the growth of nearby crops. But... By how much? 
It's kind of hard to tell. Maybe it's in the wiki or something. But I feel like we need one down in this corner as well, so I'm going to clear off. Maybe this tile here. One, two, three. Two, three. Kind of around here. Not being precise here, just uh, kind of eyeballing it. Let me put a beehive in there. Right there. Let's check a beaver's happiness here. So we got all the basic needs. We got the nutrition needs. Uh, social life. We're missing a campfire. Missing roof. Uh, flame of progress. We could build now. The carousel and the books are coming soon. The books are probably getting consumed. Someone mentioned this priority building by haulers. I don't know if I'm using this correctly. I always thought it meant like haulers should grab stuff out of here before the actual worker beavers, but not 100% sure. Okay, we're making books. Say so there's one book here. Who's gonna read the book? Carrying books, okay. Hmm. Okay, how's this going? How's this project? Oh, they're still building out the dynamite. It's gonna take a while. But then I think we'll be Pretty good to have a giant growing area here. I think I might wall this off though. And wall off here, potentially. This could all be water in here, in theory, but then we're gonna lose our growing area. We could also carve this out a little bit bigger. Not really sure what I wanna do long term. We definitely need more beavers though. Maybe not in this district. Uh, we could add more. Depends on what we want to do in this area. I think it's probably safe to make another one, but maybe we should consider food. I mean, whoa, uh, that scared me for a second. I looked at the food and it said 300, uh, but we've got 7,000 over here. But if we grow it locally, we won't have to deliver it over. Uh, so maybe we'll do that. Food, uh, farmhouse, maybe right down here by the water. Can they reach this? No, they can't reach this area here. Hmm. I thought this would be a good place, but uh, maybe it isn't the best. It's good for over here. Yeah, we could do a, we could do some crops over here though. We'll have one. Let's plant some mixture of stuff here. We'll pick some plant some carrots here. Carrots, uh, potatoes. Do I want to grow food in this district? Is that a smart thing to do? Eh, why not? We'll have like mini, mini villages. Do some wheat down here. Maybe, maybe we won't do wheat in this area. I don't know. As you can tell, I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh. Eventually, we'll, we're going to run in a growing area if we want to increase the population big time. So yeah, I think we want to do this. We're going to need a place to cook the potatoes in this area, though. So under food. We want to grill. Maybe right here. How's our storage doing? It's fine. We're gonna need more beavers, so let's put uh, another lodge in here. 
Housing, we'll go for the big one. Maybe up here. Connect that with the road. That'll increase the labor in this area so we can do some more farming. The drought's pretty much over here. Drought ended, good. Okay, I'm gonna explode these off. It's not quite ready, but... It's fun to do. Okay, that totally set that up to make it even more green. Okay, well, we're gonna do dynamite here, here, here. As long as they can reach this area. Uh, can they get up here? Probably not. We need... We need some stairs. Do some stairs here, yeah. Building lacks power. That should be fixed in a second. Maybe some stairs right... Here? You know what? I want it to be uh, like this instead, and then a platform here. I think that should work. Yeah, no unemployed beavers. Uh, hauling post five. Let's reduce that a little bit. Let's increase the probability, or not the probability, the priority on this one. And I don't want to clear all this crud out of here, so let's queue that up. This will be food as well, at some point. We don't need the berries for anything, so... Okay, we got another home in here. Our beaver population should go up. And what did I do here? Oh yeah, this is part of the part of the square there. Okay. Uh, I don't know if they can reach this or not. We might have to build stairs down instead for them to reach that. You know what? I'm I'm gonna I like that better. <laughs> Let's cancel these. Uh, Where's cancel? That's not cancel. Delete. Delete. And delete. That. Okay, let's go this way instead. We'll come down instead of going up. Okay, I could probably shave this off. We may want to, we may want that later, but uh, I think instead I'll just make a path through here, right here and here. And while we're at it, oh, that's probably fine. That's probably fine. Let's make those high priority. How are we doing for food? Good, good. What about in this district? Okay, and our food is now growing. I'm gonna prioritize planting. Now this area is not green, so this is kind of wasted, but we could extend this a little bit. I'll do some more carrots. Can't go wrong with carrots. Those will grow there. 
And I put some decorations in last time. We got the beaver monument and the little beaver statue here. I think things are going well. We probably need some more wind power for when there's a drought. Gotta figure out where I can put that. I don't know if height matters. 259. 103. Oh, that's a little one. Where can we put that and connect it? I mean, we could build some more power up here. Since this is kind of a dead area. We need a, a way over there, though. Could make a path here and a stairway up over on this side. But we need a power shaft on the way over too. Let's see if we can put more power in right now. It's the connection part that's going to be difficult. Um... I wonder if we could just put little... Put it in the water, but raise it. That's an idea. I might try that. Uh, just like offshore wind. <laughs> now, what do we need for that? We need a few of these. Too far away. It always says too far away, but then they have no problem. I'm, oh, oh, it's because they got to build them out first, I guess. So if we build a platform... Let's see. I don't know how close these can be together. Bear with me here. This might make sense. Yeah, I'm thinking like power here. How close can they be? Okay, that's the... Don't think they can be that close. So two spaces in between each one. Like that. And then connect them like this, maybe? Like that. But they're going to need a platform to build. The water can all get under this, so I think we're good. We could build some more offshore wind along here. Okay, we got this done. Let's detonate this. That's extremely satisfying. Okay, we'll delete, detonate these. And get a path going down here. And then we gotta be able to get down here so they can let this water, release this water. Hopefully this will be low enough. I'm not sure if I'm low enough here, actually. <laughs> I think I am. I think this is at the same level, so this should be lower. Yeah, that should work. We need a way down there. Let's detonate this and build a stairway down there. Right here. Carving a path. Like that, down here, stairs, and then we'll 
detonate all of this. I kind of want to get rid of this little piece here, so we'll we'll do this. Okay, how's our population in District 8? <laughs> it's growing, that's good. How's the food situation in the... How's the storage? Got a few berries in there. Carrots, grilled potatoes. And over in the other district, how are we doing? Food's going down. Slightly. Have to keep an eye on that. Water's pretty stable and full. And my power's working. Okay, good. This worked. So we could put more power one over. These are pretty cheap to build, so let's go boom, boom. And then I need two, two between. Can't reach it because I think we need to do this. Let's just build right across. Gotta use those logs or something. What do these bridges work? Four by one. Oh, we gotta unlock them. Okay, yeah, let's unlock them. We'll experiment with those later. <laughs> But they look pretty cool. As long as the food, as long as we have a decent food reserve, I'm not too worried. I gotta keep my orientation like this, because this is how I kind of started the game. How many unemployed do we have in this district? Uh, zero. Not good, it means people probably are... Wow, we need... It's because we have so many children. All our beavers are dying of old age. <laughs> well, pause some of the research here. We don't need that much. Okay, we got one unemployed, that's what I want. Okay, we also need some food in this back corner here. Let's put some more potatoes in. Potatoes, 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 potatoes. Back here. And then maybe some more wheat down here. Even though we don't have the wheat grinder thing. I wonder if we could export the wheat. Okay, how are we doing here? Uh, we can detonate this. Get our stairs in. And then they should be able to reach this and blow it all up. Not sure about these though. Oh yeah. Busy beavers. This is my first playthrough ever, really, so bear with me. <laughs> We're learning as we go. Kind of feel like this should be bigger and deeper. There's also this little bit over here. We could unblock this if we get over there. Just need to carve a path. And our district center might be too far away for that. Oh no, we can probably get over there. Destroy that, and we'll make a path through here to here. And these berries gotta go, if we can reach them.
Don't like those berries. And ultimately, sh we should probably grow trees here. Or food. Or both. Got a nice tree stand here. I should move this over. This is kind of a bad place for it. Let's move... Let's put a lumberjack over here instead. Delete this one. Okay, and make sure they can cut those down. Those are long. Our log storage is all the way over here. It's kind of a long way to go. We could put some up here instead. I think it's fine for now though. Okay. can't get through here but we're coming down this way get rid of that tree and then we should be able to demolish this demolish this and get water flowing in this little tiny thing here okay we can do a big blow up here okay we're getting close Getting close. Uh, let's carve this out. Uh, we need a way down there. Hmm. I don't think this is going to be deep enough. I think it's because I have these blocked off right now. There we go. There goes the water level. That's what I wanted. Oh yes, forgot about the gates. <laughs> the green is moving. Oh, this flooded, that's good. Oh, it's over flooding a little bit. Uh, yeah, that oh, seems okay. Looks like it over flooded a bit. Briefly. Not sure why, but it's all good now. And we want to actually preserve the water in there, so. Uh oh, drought's coming. Maybe a dam here. A dam and a levee. The reason I'm mixing it is. Uh, So we can retain a little bit more water in here once it gets in there. Okay, we're ready to blow this up. There we go. We got water. Holy green. That worked out really well. Okay. Got a massive growing area here now. We could go one level deeper. That would be better. It's going to require quite a few explosives, but uh, I think it'll be worthwhile. Log. Where did this come from? <laughs> That's a bug. What the heck? Anyway. UI bug. Okay, it went away. Good. Let's put a thing here. I want it here. Oh, you know what? We can put a stairway right here. Oh, we, no, no, that's no good. That's no good. That won't work. I'm going to delete the stairway. And we'll come down this way instead. Like that. Then we can blow up this channel. How are we doing for explosives? 101. How are we doing for other things? Paper, flour. I think we're good. I'm hearing weird things over here. I'm not sure what it is, but I think we're fine. Okay, stairs going in. And then we're gonna carve this out.
Like that. Go too deep. Then we can hopefully retain this water during droughts. Okay, how's our population in District 2 going? I should probably name these something nice. Uh, we'll call it, um... Beta. <laughs> Stupid name. And... Alpha. Could probably do some more food in our growing area here. We got lots of carrots. Uh, got lots of potatoes. Could probably use more bread. And we got the bees in there. We could use more bee coverage. Let's put a bee right here, maybe. One, two, three, and then we want coverage here-ish. Right there, maybe. Then one down here, maybe. Let me know in a comment if you know what the uh, bonus is for those. Let's just do uh, some wheat in this last little bit here. Drought started. Okay, if we want to retain the water in here. Oh, the wa oh yeah, the drought started. So, this water will flow out unless we put these up. And I got to remember to remove them when the drought finishes. We don't really need it right now because it's not nothing's really growing. But uh, that's the idea. I might explode this away so we can put another house right beside it. Yeah, why not? Let's do this right here. And we don't have any rooftop terraces on this area yet, so I will want to get one of those in. I definitely want to carve this open. I want to flood this whole thing. And then eventually flood this. We need to get over here as well sometime. And I might want to move my district center over even more. Maybe to this corner. Because this one... Yeah, I'm not sure. We'll see. I don't know if there's any point making more population in uh, this area. We're up to unemployed nine again. Let's turn the, these back on. Wow. And get some more haulers going. Oh, unemployed 14. All the kids grew up. How's the research? 6,700. We need 12,000. I'm gonna bang out these small ones just to uh, get rid of them. Scarecrow. Okay, do they get a bonus, bonus for that? Beaver statue. those beehives in. 
in the holes that I made right there. And I think I made one... Well, we definitely need one down here. I thought I made another hole somewhere, but maybe I didn't. Oh yeah, it's right there. Need a few in here. Three and three, I think right there will be good. Okay, water, 2400, food, 7000, yeah, we're good. Still good, I don't think they can reach this here, so let's maybe cancel that. And they missed some. Maybe they grew back. I kind of want to detonate these, but we'll let them finish. I don't know if they can get down here. No, we need a stairway down there. Let's make a stairway for them right here. Okay, I'm going to blow this up. Maybe that was a bad idea. <laughs> Uh, cause they should be able to walk here. Construction site is too far away from builders. Build more paths or a new district. Okay. Can we build a path over this? No. Maybe we need to go around the outside. I can always delete these later. I don't think they're going to be able to reach that, but let's just see what happens here. Okay, so that's the range is right there. Oh, they're getting in there. I think just just needed the stairs. The terraforming has begun. Okay, all this water is not getting through. How is this watered? Is it getting the water from here, I guess? This is a pretty extensive drought. The water didn't fall through here, though. I guess this dam is not good enough. Yeah, the dam is retaining some of the water. Uh, it's retaining this. Yeah, if we open that up, we're going to lose some water here and stuff. So maybe that's fine. Most of this is still green. We need another beehive. Uh, one, two, one, two, three, right here. You know, in a comment, if you know how bad the droughts get, like, are we talking uh, like 20 day drought? Does that ever happen on basic settings? Default settings. Can they reach these? How the heck am I going to get down there? Well, we'll blow it up and then we'll figure out how we need to get in there. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
It's all about trapping the water. Are we out of dynamite? No, oh, we're low. The drought has ended, yay! Okay, we we're gonna put some more power in here. Like... Oh, this stuff's in the way. Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to go up here. Power shaft. High power shaft. How do these work? I think this lets us go up one. So we could we could work our way up here. I think. Yeah, what if we do this? Yeah, we could put wind power up there. We do a thing here. Triple platform, double platform. Yeah, if we snake the power up that way, and then also have a way for them to get up there. I want to build in that hole. <laughs> Can't see it though. Double, uh... So power shaft up here. Up here. I think I might need to blow this up. We need a way up here. <laughs> um, I need to start the stairs back here, actually. Hmm. Yeah, what happens if we start back here? And then we build a big power farm up here. I think it'll work quite well. Probably overdone it with the power, but... Uh, <laughs> we have lots of planks, that's for sure. Paper... Books... Any idle little beavers do we have? Unemployed two. Maybe we need some more housing in here. Probably need some more warehouses as well. I wanted to get rid of these ones. But we need an underground one to kind of take care of the excess. Uh, that one's full. That one's full. Hmm. Where can we put some more storage? Could go up a bit here. I kind of want to build it right here, but... We need a temporary big storage in order to... get rid of all the stuff we have right now. For now, let's put it over here. Storage, massive one right here. I know that's out of the way, but... That way we can empty these. And replace them. Kind of wanted to put some more housing in here. We just need a nice place to put it. I think right here, actually. Housing, triple decker, right there beauty. And we got some roof decks up here for them. 
I think that'll work well. Water's a little bit low. Probably gonna need some more water storage. As we add more beavers. But we got a good surplus right now. How do we do over here? They got pretty far. Let's just do some massive detonation. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, they need a way down to the bottom here. And then, I guess a path to here, kind of way up. Here they come. <laughs> and I gotta remember to open these up. I kind of don't want to have to remember to do this every single time, but... Uh, might just be the way it goes. No automation in this game yet. Lots of uh, log storage. <laughs> Probably need some more. How far away are we from the center? Getting pretty red over here. I think it wouldn't hurt to put these in. And we could probably use more water storage over here as well, but uh, let's see how things are going. How's storage? Water. I guess water can't be stored near. Thought it could. Oh, they built these. Okay, let's detonate. More room for housing later on. Only 300 water. That's a little bit low. I know they'll import more, but... Kind of want some more water storage. Guess we could put some in here. A pump and some storage. Right down near the bottom. Like right here, maybe? It seems to be like a perfect spot for it. And maybe put the storage uh, up here in kind of a dead zone. It's a little ways for them to run, but we could also put it right here. Okay, that's done. Did they get to here? Yes, they did. Okay, that's done. That stair we can go. So we're ready to put whatever we want in here. Delicious plants, food, whatever we need. I also want to think about 
doing something with this whole region. I could do something similar. We could carve a channel through here. Through this bottom region. So that we could open up all this for growing. If need be. Okay, how do we do with this path here? Uh, we're gonna blow this up. Actually, why do I want to... I need to blow this up so we can get the power up there. The last power lift. Right. Is that what we want? Is that what I wanted? You know what? I think I made a boo-boo. I think I needed that there. <laughs> we'll put the platform back in. Right in this hole, if that's right. Uh, like that. Okay, now if we do like a junction, might as well go four away. Even though we might not ever use it, we'll do it. And now we can have a massive amount of windmills up here. this. Massive wind power. All we need is batteries. Oh yeah, my storage. Should we get this emptied? Uh, capacity zero. Yep. Delete that. Delete that. Now we can go underground with these. I kind of got some wasted space right there. How much do these cost? 40 gears. How many gears do we have? 300? Yeah, we're good. Unemployed six. Let's turn some of these on. All these inventors, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them once we got all the science done. I'm not sure that I've built the uh, Flame of Progress yet. I don't think I built that yet. What does it cost? 4,000 blanks. Jeez. got quite the radius. Where do we want it? Um, where can we put it? We could put it um, on top of a roof. Hmm. That would cover all the inventors. I think we just want it in a high traffic area. Where they all go by. We could clear out some trees and put it right here. I think that would be a good spot. And we're at the one hour mark, so... I might wrap it up pretty soon here. Let's just get these cleared out here. Flooded building. Uh-oh, what have I done? Oops. <laughs> okay, that'll be good for when it's... drier. Okay, we cleared that out. Now we can make that monument. Is this definitely where I want it? Uh, yeah, I think that's good. I'm gonna... Let's build it high priority, because I want to see how it works with the beavers passing by. I'm seeing hungry beavers. Oh wow, we're at <laughs> 9200 carrots now. 
or food. I guess we'll save this for next time. I just wanted to see if they walk by it, whether they get charged up with it, but it's going to take a while to build, and we're at the one hour mark, so. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, trying to get that, hit that 100k subscribers. Probably won't do it in this year, but maybe in 2022. Hope you enjoyed this one. As always, thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.